Oh, the, the llamas, the tree topper, that was kind of cool. Oh, I think that house was like over by Greasy. Okay, that laugh was kind of creepy, but uh. So apparently there's planes in here, but before we jump into the game, we're going to uh, go through the battle pass quick. And yes, I'm poor, so I just buy the regular one, not the uh, bundle or whatever where you get a big head start. So we'll look at this a little bit more in depth here. So first outfit. I think it just changes colors with it, yeah. That's pretty cool. Second outfit. Okay, so this is the one I saw on the loading screen. And then changes colors. Those look pretty cool actually. Let's think about the battle pass. They never disappoint on just like upgrading them. What is this? They put weapon skins in. That's so sick. So you can put it on different guns or whatever. You can put weapon skins. That's so awesome. I'm actually super surprised about that whole weapon skin thing. That's, uh, that's crazy. All right, anyways, continuing, uh, back bling. That's kind of cool. Um, another weapon skin music. So just like, um, Christmas music. A glider. That's kind of cool. Oh, I forgot the... Oh, a little golf clap. I like that. A Christmas GG. Oh, they added a hamster back playing. I was wondering if they were going to continue with the animals thing, because like, it was all hyped up at first, and then it kind of stopped. Back playing. A lot of their characters now, like for the Battle Pass, that's kind of cool, the whole llama thing. A lot of the characters for the Battle Pass are like... Sec like tears now. Dance. Oh, and another gun wrap. We actually have uh, hockey pucks. That's kind of cool. I wonder if there's like hockey rings. Another glider. Another dog variant. Pickaxe. That's kind of cool. That glider is pretty cool. I like that. Another weapon wrap. <laughs> That's a good one. Um, another. I gotta get back to it. Another skin. That's cool. Um, more music. Okay, yeah, this disco music. Backpack. Another gun wrap, dance, that skin looks kind of funny, another back bling there as well, they really put a lot of um, like gun wraps in here, that's kind of cool, glider, that's cool, um, another hamster on the backpack, like a Der Burger pajamas, that's kind of cool. More music. Mm, 
another ice back back there. Dance again, and then the tier 100 skin. There's only four tiers on it this time. Usually I think there's seven. That looks pretty cool. Honestly though, my, my favorite one of the battle pass might be um, this one, to be honest. That like all red variant I thought was pretty cool. So I'm gonna jump into some playground, go around the new section of the map. I believe they added a winter corner down by Greasy because that's where like the iceberg came up. I'm gonna go look there, I'm gonna go grab. I know there's planes in here, zip lines. Um, I don't really know what else. So we're just gonna kinda test all the new things out. Oh, so they made the starting island snowy as well. That's kind of cool. Wow, they added so many things. So there's frosty flight, so I'm guessing that this is an airport. Yep, just the airport with the runway. That's cool. Um, where else? Um... Viking still there, Snobby's half snowy, Soccer Stadium still there, Tilted's a little snowy. Um, I'll just try to go to, oh, here's some zip lines. I should probably try one of these. I don't, I think, I saw someone just, okay, so you just jump up to it. And I think you can go up as well. Yeah, you can. Okay, so you can go up and down. That's kind of cool. I feel like some people are gonna hit like crazy like trick shots off of those because like you can jump and then spin off of them. That's kind of cool. Oh, that's awesome. So like that was right. There was a, a skin for the vehicles or whatever. That's so dope that they added that. I know so many people wanted weapon skins. Okay, here we go. I'm not 100% sure if there's like spawns anywhere else. So I think only one person can fly and then I saw people, I think you can sit here, here. So you can actually sit four people. Okay, that was the guns. So you just hit X and you go. And then you drive with the left stick. You can bank with the bumper buttons. You can slow down and then you do have a gun on here. Obviously not completely 100% accurate, but... So there's a lake that like submerged some houses, so they might change that and like add stuff to that. I'm trying to think. Oh, I gotta go over here to the new... So there's Polar Peak up here. So I think this is the thing that everyone was like looking at. And I'm, sh I'm pretty sure it probably has like an underground layer. Maybe where you can go in there or whatever. And then over here, it is Happy Hamlet. So it just looks like another town. And then they made a lot of the other areas snowy. Loot Lake looks to be the same. Um, I'm trying to make sure I try, like don't miss any obvious changes on the map, but like I don't think they changed much else. I did see a scar. I want to grab it and just look what the skin looks like on it. That looks so awesome. So I think that basically is everything new on the map part. I'm pretty sure. I think this is going to kind of change the game a lot. And then with the airplanes too, like they don't move like insanely fast across the map. Like you can't go from like the bottom all the way to the top in a crazy amount of time. They move pretty slow. And I just answered my own question. They do spawn other places too. And taking off isn't that hard either. They kind of do it for you. So that part's nice. Oh, and then the rune areas. I didn't even think about that. Those are kind of grown over now. Okay. All right, we're gonna go try creative mode because I know there was a lot of hype around that. Funny thing about this video too, is I tried to get up at like 5 a.m. this morning to record it and my game was not updated. So I literally woke up at 5 a.m. for nothing and then I went back to sleep and I had to get up at seven to go to my class. So today was just very interesting. 
So you have to start a server. Or maybe I'm joining someone's, I honestly don't know. But if you can start a server and get like 50 people in there, or like, I mean, I probably couldn't get 50 people in there, but like, people like, ho not hosting your own tournaments, but like, that'd be insane. So you can fly too. That's cool. So you can copy and paste stuff. I'm definitely gonna have to look into this a little bit more because I'm not. I don't completely understand what's going on. This looks super cool, and I think it's gonna be like the whole one v oneing people, and instead of just going into playground and build battles, like doing this and. I think it's going to really change how stuff goes. So that is going to do it for my season seven overview. Um, I didn't go completely into depth on the creative mode. I'm not a hundred percent on understanding it quite yet, but I probably will make a video on the future about it just of like a one V one or something crazy like that. But other than that, make sure you guys smash that like button subscribe if you are new and I will see you in the next one whenever it is. Peace.